Hey, what's up? This is uh, Enchanted Media Productions. How are you guys doing today? This video is strictly for people who are looking to hire a videographer and they are looking for someone and here I am. I videotape weddings, 316s, anniversaries, anything that you want on stage, doesn't matter. I can make it live, you know, make it a live event or just again, edit the videos and have it for you. Now say you like my work and uh, you want to hire me and I will communicate with you and we'll sign a contract uh, depending on the package and what you choose. The smaller package, which will be one videographer or you choose the bigger package, which will be two videographers. I will film your entire day. So it could be anywhere from uh, nine to 10 hours uh, with the silver package and for the bigger package, it would be 10 to 12 hours. So I'm basically with you the entire day. Uh, I, when I normally go solo, I'll just use one camera and I'll film everything with different lenses. Like this one is an 18 to 35 and I can shoot with a 24 75 as well. Then from there, you know, I will meet up with you. Uh, of course, before that, um, you know, once I contact you, I will ask you for your itinerary. Um, and that way I know what the schedule looks like. So on the day of, I will uh, go to the bride's house and if the groom happens to be nearby, and I say, if you have a hotel and he's nearby in the same hotel, I will meet up with the groom and film him as well. But my main focus is to film the bride. Uh, in the Sweet 16 case, obviously it will be the Sweet 16 girl. Uh, if you have bridesmaids or, or a Sweet 16 court, uh, I will film them in their natural ways, whatever they're talking about. Usually I'll tell them to talk about you. Uh, normally I like to get there way before uh, the bride gets dressed and, uh, and I'll be filming the rings, the flowers, the, the, the invitation. Once we leave from there, whether it's an hour, an hour and a half, two hours later, we'll head out to either the church or the venue and uh, we'll set up for the ceremony as far as the wedding is concerned. And uh, again, depending on the package, I'll have one camera uh, or two. Uh, if you choose the bigger package, I, I could have up to three cameras. I basically, I set up, I'll meet up with the groom. I'll mic him up. I'll make sure I'll have a microphone, which will be wireless. You know, I film the ceremony, you walk, the bride walks down the aisle. I'll film more of that, every detail. At the end of the day, uh, we'll go to a park. We'll film there as well. And then from there, we'll go to the venue. That's if the ceremony is at a church. But if the ceremony is at a venue, and there's two ways of doing this. In the beginning, he walks down the aisle in the ceremony and he's waiting for his bride to come. But sometimes, you know, what's called a first look where the groom is at the venue and we'll, the photographer and the videographer, which is myself, will set up a nice little area, whether it's a gazebo or a nice little park within the venue. And we'll set up one camera or two cameras and we'll have the bride uh, come up to the, the groom, tap him on the shoulders, and he turns around and you see his expression. Then from there, uh, again, those are the two parts. One, he meets her for the first time, sees her walking down the aisle with the dress on, or the first look where she taps him on the shoulder. From there, uh, there's the cocktail going on. Um, I'll film a little bit of that. Sometimes I have the guests say something to the bride and groom and uh, and then i'll meet up with the then after that i'll meet up with the dj i'll hook up a standalone recorder uh where i'll record his music and the microphone directly into the recorder once i do that and i press record i leave that alone there i set up my lights and you know in the angles that i need normally it's two tripods the lights are about 10 feet high and from there you know the the uh major d introduces and they come out and they celebrate the music is going and then the bride and groom so i'm filming basically up to three and a half hours or four hours worth of video i also create what's called highlight reels some people ask me you know can you do a video that's just highlights and don't worry about the documentary would you charge cheaper 
I mean, I really don't because it's still a documentary. I'm filming, you know, a story throughout the whole entire day. Uh, but some people also want the unedited version. But in the bigger package, that's already included. So I can put that already, take the scenes that I didn't put in the original video and put it in a separate file. So there's three ways of me sending your video. Uh, one is through USB where I can mail it to you. The other way is through Google, uh, where I can send you the link through Google, through your email. Then finally, which is one of my best favorite ways of sharing video is what's called Webflow. And the Webflow, it's like a DVD. So think about when back in the days when we used to take a DVD and put it, you know, to watch. You have chapters, you have play movie chapters. Again, you get play movie, you get a nice picture of whatever, you know, I take the best picture of your day and I put it there as a, a menu. So, you know, different pictures here and everything is something different. So for example, this is play movie, this is closing highlight, this is deleted scenes and another one deleted scenes on that side. And once you have that link, I put a password. And once you have that, um, you can share the whole entire video to anybody around the world to your family and friends and whoever you want to. Let's say you don't have a link to be able to share your wedding video to other family members. The only way you can do that is by copying it into USB and then sending out the USB to someone. So I think this way and copy the link and sharing it to them uh, with the technology today, I think that's a great option. And I highly recommend to have your wedding or Sue 16 or any type of event uh, as a link so where you can share it and you can see it on your own phone. So anyway, that's it. Thank you for watching. This is Enchanted Media Productions. God bless you. And until next time, peace. I get to love you. to love